Oh boy, I see our other community around floor and take over everywhere. Now, ladies, now swim now, one swim cross. You didn't have you. Ah, boy. So sad, 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 sad. As I talk to you now, more than 18 states for Nigeria, don't they affected by this flood? Hey, my people now welcome to my youtube channel my name is Emin Jeremiah and I'll always they put my mouth for things they consign me and you directly or indirectly for Nigeria so if this is like your first time they watch my youtube channel join the family by subscribing commenting liking then share my baby we'll news now say floor don't take over so many parts of Nigeria as I talk to you now so many parts of Nigeria now so many persons don't they displaced they don't lost their shelter as a result of this flood, we don't cross over more than 18 parts for Nigeria. You know what we tend to say? Our president is silent for this matter. They're very loud. We don't expect to hear from them. Everybody, they look. They can come out, come talk something about this flood. We never hear anything. Make you correct me if I did wrong. We never hear anything from the federal level. We all know say most of the um, states. The state governors, they don't they battle with them on their own. But most of them not even come out with their mouths. You could talk like states like um, Anambra, um, Bayasa. Most of them don't come out with their mouth. Oh. Come beg the federal government. Maybe federal government come to their aid. As I talk to you now, cops don't even float for water. People don't die. If you see where these people they stay, like if you see where these people they accommodated now even you you go cry you go weep beaver states now where are they now we don't yes say because no yes on we go down this was i think a hundred billion or so for that thing but my people if you go that if you go there now go see where that place they you said no go believe say now where they don't this was a billion naira now, so I may talk to you now, Governor. Yes, on Wiki. Don't go Lagos State. Go contribute 300 million naira. He contributes that money to women where they do politics for um, the wives of politicians for Lagos State. Now, what I want to ask now, please say, he get any money, we go day enough for cases like this. I beg, most of us for River State don't want to say, I beg, who need this money more? The wives of politicians or these people where don't they displaced? Due to due to flooding, now you go say uh, after all, you don't contribute money there. We know you don't contribute money there now. But he get any money? We suppose they enough. He get any money? We suppose they enough for scenarios like this. Like when you contribute, you go say you don't contribute enough. So so you don't do okay. Meanwhile, if you go these places, my people, you don't we go you don't go weep. If you go these places, these people don't they complain, no food, no good water, no even better shelter for these people to stay. Now they talk based on state level. When I remember say this the way it happened that national natural disaster. You're not supposed to be like you're not supposed to be state alone where they carry on for head. The federal level, we suppose don't hear something. We suppose don't hear say okay, see what in federal level don't do. What in the federal level don't contribute to see what in they don't put in place. So we suppose don't hear anything. I bet you're not correct me. I'm not gonna tell me. When I don't hear anything, where it be say the federal level don't contribute per se. Now, not people forget say that this flood they happen every two to three years. You no, know, they come unannounced. You no, know, they come unannounced. If, if you know within the cause of this flood, you suppose no say government they know months before the flood actually take place. You know they come unannounced. Now all they know say and uh, Cameroon they don't open their dam. They make Nigeria they, they experience flooding. Now most of us know these things. Now Cameroon they just they open their dam. Then they don't inform they, they suppose don't inform government before they open that dam. In short, I believe say they don't inform government before they open that dam. And if they never if they don't inform government before they open that dam, that means the government of Nigeria gets right to sue them. And then make me as still insist say the government don't know forehand like months before this flood actually they take place. Now, first of all, why Cameroon open the dam? Now, make a let me go back history a little. If you get an idea of what a dam be like, at the show now, now is that how a dam supposed to look like? The aim of this dam now that collects the um, currents, that's the force where River Niger they bring water. Then go channel that current now, put to this 
channel out to this particular dam now so that when that water they come the force of that water will they turn this machine i don't know this me no we call a machine this machine waiting for this dam now why that machine they turn you go then generate um, power generate irrigation so many things now i, I don't know whether you understand me now see this dam where you know they see now eh? now this dam now then build them basically to use that side that force way water they take come they generate electricity when they build this thing now as the water they come as the water they come now the current where that water they they, they use they come now it go they use them they they turn that machine at the end to where they that way actually that machine or i don't know what in the name wait for that dam now as that thing they turn now it go they generate power if you understand what i talk now you go not say that water is supposed to be a certain level for that machine to defeat the turn well but when that water don't overflow when it don't overflow probably because maybe then to the experience rain or any other thing the water don't come full to the brain that means that machine goes spoil and that's you no know, go they work well so they will need to open that dam make some of the water come out so that the water will stay there on a normal level so this is the exactly what thing happen with this cameroon dam the water be not over full so then gas open them make the water come out so that water will date to a certain level so that then the dam no go spoil now once cameroon open that dam <laughs> the water will come straight to nigeria now look gonna listen to me when cameroon build this dam that was in the 80s in the 70s 80s when cameroon build this dam Nigeria supposed to also build their own town. That was the agreement. Cameroon built their dam. Nigeria, they do ago, 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 ago. T. I said they talk to you now. That dam when Nigeria starts, they eventually abandon them. But normally, as it's supposed to be, when Cameroon open their own dam, that water will flow. Suppose actually enter our own dam. I don't know why I don't understand what they talk. That water will flow from Cameroon. It's supposed to just actually enter our own dam but as nigeria not get their own dam now and so the thing flow enter people farms enter people houses enter people where people they stay if you understand which are they talk now you're gonna say kemara not you open this dam without informing nigeria but before they go don't open this dam they go don't inform Ni nigeria government three to even even a year say they go don't inform them because if they don't inform nigeria government nigeria government get the right to sue them yes they get the right to sue them because they supposed to inform nigeria government now as they inform nigeria government most more as you said that that's that is to say each flooding will happen nigerians they always they are aware each flooding will not will happen nigeria government they always they are aware prior to the flooding so now waiting nigeria government put in place so okay when this thing don't happen no okay see you see what thing go happen no see what thing go happen no and by the way what the make nigeria government go all just sit and wait say okay when cameroon open their dam any year any time cameroon open their dam what would they face this thing when actually we fit solve that solution once and for all yes now all of them they call, call them natural disaster now, natural disaster yes i agree in a natural disaster but this kind of natural this, this kind of natural disaster you know come on and now you know come on and now what is the provision where they put in place say, okay when this thing don't come oh this thing will come in the next um, one year and oh, um, six months oh, okay when this thing don't come oh, see the provisions where i get for my citizen what will be the uh, what will be the, this way they've been put in place now as i talk to you now this fraud will come it will go when it go everybody will pretend like say we don't know say this thing will come again nobody go talk about them again everybody go move on like say no you know even like saying that kind of thing they happen then when they come three years again we will start all over again that i will call a run health task scatter like saying our waiting never happened before like say this is where they happen we never see them before <laughs> Now it will be like say at two they won't blame government for everything. Make I tell you, my people, if this thing may affect them directly, if this thing they affect the airlines directly, you feel say solution for never come for this thing. You feel say solution for never come. If you say the way they now where they will leave them after three years again or four or two years, it will come again. It isn't as soon as supposed to. It is isn't for never create permanent solution to this thing. If really this thing affects 
these people. But make us stop this video here. Now, if you don't watch this video up to this extent, thank you. Very, thank you very much. I will see you for my next video. Bye-bye.